Good evening. I'm here live at the Adirondack Bank Center for day two of the IIHF Women's World Championship here in Utica. Tonight, Team Canada gets its journey underway against Finland. The Finns coming off a 4-0 loss yesterday to Czechia and looking to bounce back here in their second of four preliminary round contests. Now, we've already had a couple of games go final here at the odd today. In the first game of the day, China topped Japan 3-2 in a shootout in Group B play. China's goalie Zhehui Zhan made 50 saves in that one to help solidify the win. Now, just wrapping up, within the hour here at the Odd, another Group B contest between Denmark and Germany, with the Germans opening up their tournament with a 5-1 win. Denmark, meanwhile, falling to 0-2 in the preliminary round. But it was Gold Light's red glare here last night. The hosts and defending champion Team USA returned to home ice for the first time in seven years for this competition and came away with a 4-0 win over Switzerland. The U.S. outshot the Swiss 55-11. So it was a perilous fight for Switzerland and could have been a lot worse if not for the play of goalie Andrea Brandley, who made 51 saves. Now, after the game last night, we caught up with players to get their thoughts on the atmosphere here in Utica. One from just down the road in Rochester and another from across the pond. Yet both seem to share the same sentiment. That was awesome. A lot of energy. I think all the girls were super excited to kind of get going and, like you said, on home soil. So, uh, yeah, a few nerves and jitters in first period, but kind of worked those out and uh, just kept kept working. I know it took us a few to kind of break their goalie, but um, obviously just kept putting a lot of shots on and got a few through, so that was awesome. Oh, it was amazing. You know, we knew coming in that it's probably going to be packed, especially with, like, the growth of women in ho women's hockey that has been happening yeah. this year. So, you know, I was really pumped for that because there's no – you know better place to play in than like against the home team so it's like it was really cool everyone was really pumped up for that and uh, it was it was an amazing atmosphere everyone like the fans really showed up and like cheered for everyone and it was it was an amazing atmosphere and you know i don't think that's uh, something that can happen everywhere so shout out to the crowd here in utica to you know show up today so a ringing endorsement from athletes on both teams but are we really surprised Utica showcasing its passion for the game to the world? The U.S. off today, but are back at it tomorrow against Czechia in the second of four preliminary round contest. Meanwhile, last year's silver medalists, Team Canada, taking on Finland here at the top of the hour. Reporting. I'll have highlights and more coming up tonight at 11. Reporting from the Adirondack Bank Center site of the 2024 IIHF Women's Worlds. Spencer Davidson, News Channel 2 Sports. We're back to wrap things up after the break.